Guilty or not guilty, jurors are deciding what happens next to two former Williamson County Sheriff's deputies charged with the in-custody death of Javier Ambler. Thanks for joining us, everyone. I'm Mike Rush, in for Daniel Marine. And I'm Britt Moreno. Ambler died after a 20-minute long chase with police ended in a crash and then an arrest. James Johnson and Zach Camden are accused of acting recklessly while detaining Ambler by using a taser, even though he told officers he had a heart condition. KXAN's Mercedes Hernandez sat in court once again today, and she was there as both sides gave their closing arguments. Mercedes. Yes, things got emotional from both the defense and the prosecution. One side saying that the deputies responded exactly how they were trained. The other saying that Ambler died, a complying man. Now the state started first. They gave a refresher about the history of the trial, starting back to day one when jurors watched the first of many body cam videos from that night to testimony about Ambler's body from the Travis County Medical Examiner. Assistant DA Holly Taylor repeated a phrase she used in her opening statement to the jury that officers, quote, gave Ambler two seconds to comply and two minutes to die. The defense followed right after, relying heavily on the week's testimonies from law enforcement officers that said Johnson and Camden acted within reason and that they believed Ambler was resisting officers. They also said the state did not work to secure evidence like data from Ambler's Fitbit and phones and that these charges were only brought against the defendant for the DA's political gain. We did what other officers would do too. Get him in handcuffs, make him safe so he can't hurt us, he can't hurt himself, he can't hurt a third person, he can't run, and then we will get him medical care. That's exactly what happened. It was during the state's rebuttal to the defense's argument that things got emotional. One of the prosecutors telling the jury Ambler died begging for his life. The simple fact that Javier Ambler died, a surrendering man, a complying man, and a begging man. And again, the jury is deliberating right now. They could come back with a verdict tonight or tomorrow. There's no telling just when yet. At the Travis County Courthouse, Mercedes Hernandez, KXAN News. Thanks, Mercedes.